And we are back for another episode of Pack and Play, making the playoffs at an 8-2 and two record. Of course, a couple games were not uploaded as, you know, I made a couple people quit. And then a couple games I got lagged out of. So I'm sure you guys didn't want to see that. But hopefully we get this W, divisional round game. Here we go. All right, so right away, looking at this roster, I can feel the menus are super laggy. Hopefully we don't have to deal with that. Amari Cooper, Martavis Bryant at wide receiver. A couple of decent offensive linemen. Robert Mathis, Mario Edwards Jr. wrote of the playoffs. Haloti Nada. So a couple of cards here. Nothing that's too crazy. So hopefully we can get this win. I'm actually using a new playbook. So if I make a couple of mistakes here, don't mind me. I mean, I'm just tired of using the Saints playbook. I'm mostly using a new playbook because, like, the Saints playbook has a lot of, like, plays that I run that's really, really kind of boring. And I run it all the time. So definitely looking forward to using this book. Nice first down there for Jarvis Landry. Going to try an inside zone here. There's a lot of inside zone plays in this playbook. So definitely looking forward to that. Mark Ingram's going to go ahead and bust out. Kind of wish he was a little bit faster, though. Not going to lie. Still on the road of pulling a new running back. I'm trying to get something, like, really nice. Someone really fast. Maybe, like, a tree archer. Kind of be cheesy about it. I think there's a new Darren Sproles in the game. That'd be pretty cool to pull. Uh, I think he's only, like, 90 speed. But definitely something I could work with for sure. And, you know, there's always a chance I could pull a legend like Eric Dickerson. That would be nice. We got J.J. Nelson wide open for the first down. And that's going to be a touchdown going up by a pro pack. Going to go up 7-0 here on my opponent. Definitely a nice way to start this game off for sure. All right, so first possession for my opponent. Andre Ellington's going to take the handoff and go up the middle for a gain of, like, one or two. Even somebody like Andre Ellington would be nice to pull. Maybe, like, Andre Ellington, Chris Johnson, David Johnson. Any of the Cardinals running backs I'd be happy with. Also, I do want to say, if you guys don't know, we are doing that Christmas promo giveaway. So if you guys want to go ahead and go back to the previous video and enter into that, you can. Like myself and Len have been saying, just trying to give back to you guys a little bit. I mean, it's a pretty decent giveaway. I think 100 PSN, 100 Xbox, Microsoft points. So yeah. And then, of course, the third slot, you can either win 500K on PS4, or if you win on Xbox, you get 50 additional dollars worth of Microsoft points. But first 9 of 10 for my opponent, he's eating me alive right now with the runs. And he's going to find a receiver here, probably. I can't catch up to him. That's going to be a first down. Actually, second down in inches, but Andre Ellington takes the handoff to the right, and he gets a first down pretty easily. And that is not good. Looks like we got a little bit of hurry up here. Not sure what he wants to do. Probably Ellington right to the right side again. Nope, he's going to be passing the ball. And we got the interception. Let's go. Jonathan Cyprian read that like a book. Kind of played off of it a little bit, but we got the pick. All right, so I'll definitely take that. We got the ball back here. First down at 10. Nothing is open. I don't even know what to do here. Just try to run around with Osweiler, see if anything gets open. Go out of bounds. I'm not taking a sack. That's, like, the one thing I hate in Madden. Like, I can't stand taking sacks or, you know, fumbling, obviously. But we're going to find J.J. Nelson again. That route's deadly. All right, so first down at 10 here. Nothing is open. I can't even run here. I'm just going to have to throw it away. Boink. Maybe he's getting smart to my passes. I'm not sure. Shane Wynn is open, and that's going to be a first down. Let's go. It's probably going to have enough time to score here if we score pretty quick. Agram's up the middle for a gain of one. All right, second down and eight. Play action. We're looking for R1, but he's not going to be able to get open. Trying to get any yards I can with Osweiler. It's kind of crazy. I mean, Osweiler does have a little bit of mobility in this game, so really, like, <laughs> okay, so what happened there was, like, you know how you cut the drop back off with R2? I cut off the drop back, and then I went into, like, a running animation, and then he just threw it on the run. So nothing I could do there. But we are back up by another pro pack. 10 nothing. So, yeah, definitely way too much time for my opponent. Now, two minutes. He's going to find Ellington on the wheel. Big hit by Cyprian. Second down and one. I'm trying to concentrate here because I feel like he's going to throw another pick. Come on, get him. Oh, my goodness. Pick that off, Washington. That must be some sort of like an awareness thing. I don't know why that happens, but wow, Anthony Barr right up the gap, getting the stop. Going for it on fourth down. We need to make a play here. He's going deep. We got DJ Hayden, and we're going to get mossed on by Martavis Bryant. Wow. Luckily, he's only really been using Ellington, but he does have Martavis Bryant. He does have Amari Cooper. Hopefully, they don't get loose because that was not good. All right, so he's got a minute left to do something here. Come on, let's get a big sack. He finds an open receiver, and that is going to be a first down. Yeah, right now I feel like I just can't really stop him or do anything about it. There's going to be a catch for Amari Cooper, and that's going to be a touchdown. Taking away a pro pack. Oh, well. I mean, what can you do? Do we have a miracle left in us? 32 seconds. We move the ball pretty well. Finding Shane Wynn, that's not going to be a catch. Let's go, Osweiler. Let's make a big throw here. Jarvis Landry for the first down. 22 seconds about left on the clock. 
Oh, we got JJ now. Oh my goodness, we take a sack. Shit. Damn, I had Nelson wide open on that last play. That sucks. Second to 22, find Fourier. Just try to set up for a big throw here. I don't know if I can really make it to the end zone, but we'll try. Pretty sure Osweiler has like 95 throw power, so I might make it right to like the 10-yard line here. But we're going to make it to the end zone. That's Jordy Nelson, and that's going to be a drop. I actually thought he caught that for a second. That sucks. I'm going to go ahead and try it one more time. Going to take a sack, and that's going to be halftime. All right, so 10-7 to 7 going into the third quarter here. He's going to find his tight end. That's going to be close to a first down. Feels like everything's not going my way right now. Definitely need something to go my way. Intercepted, baby. White caught it. I'm just at a loss for words right now. Like, I don't get it. And there goes Amari Cooper. So, Martavis Bryant, Amari Cooper. Pair of touchdowns. Takes away all our pro packs. Wow. You ever hear that saying that everything that can go wrong will go wrong? And there's some big lag, but we got Mark Ingram breaking free. Can we make this guy miss? And the worst lag I've ever felt in my life. That's going to be a big time first down. The lag is getting like progressively worse and worse. Hopefully that doesn't screw me. Play action fake. We got an open receiver. That's Jordy Nelson. And we're going to go ahead and possession catch that. I do not want to take a you know risk of fumbling. That's definitely one thing that I have not done this game that I feel like I'm going to is fumble the ball. Uh, no idea what I'm doing there with Mark Ingram. Next play. Second down and 12. We got Osweiler looking. We got Jarvis Landry. And that'll set up for a third down play. Jarvis Landry wide open. And I possession caught it. Why did I do that? That's honestly like my fault because I've been possession catching everything lately. Because I don't want to fumble. Um, I guess it really doesn't make sense. So I mean I could just catch and run. But what in the world is this lag? Are you kidding me? Like, like I said, everything that can go wrong is going wrong right now. Me making mistakes. Lag. Wow. Nothing's open. All right, so big fourth down coming up, guys. I don't know if I'm going to get it. Damn, nothing's open again. Can we get lucky? Throwing it to X, and that's not going to be a touchdown. Shit. Well, hopefully we can somehow get a stop here. Call a couple timeouts. Ellington up the middle for a couple of yards. Couldn't stop Ellington in the first quarter, though, so hopefully we can now. And, yeah. Spoke too soon. This might actually be a loss. I'm kind of feeling it. Ellington is just unstoppable right now. He's not fumbling. Damn. Fullback dive up the middle. Another first down. He is just eating me alive on these runs. I just can't get lucky. Another big hit. No fumble. Oh, he's actually going to pass the ball here. He's going for it all. Come on. Okay, we stopped it. I thought I was going to get the pick. Big third down. What's he going to do? He's going to take a hit. Let's go, man. Fourth down. What in the world is he going to do now? He's going to take the field goal. He's going to go for it. He's taking the field goal. So, I mean, at worst, we're going to go ahead and try to tie up the game. I'm not sure his field goal kicker is. The kick is not going to be good. Wide right. We actually have a chance. Let's go, man. Well, I guess all my bad luck is kind of turning around now. We got the ball back. We got Mark Ingram on the flat. He's going to miss a tackle. Another tackle close to a first down, Mark Ingram. He's got everybody on the D-line right now. That's going to be like an all-out blitz. Got X open. That's Fourier for the first down. And more. He's going to miss a tackle. Fourier cutting up field and getting down. Definitely liking my chances now. First down and 10. Mark Ingram to the left. And we're going to have some open space here. Take a big hit, but luckily no fumble. Clock is ticking. 40 seconds to go. Mark Ingram again. Another big hit. No fumble. Going to try out my secret weapon play. Let's see if it works. Oh, no. I'm under pressure. We got Fourier wide open on the right side. And that, my friends, is a touchdown. Back up by a pro pack. Taking the lead. Let's get it. We got the lead back. Let's win this game. Definitely a Hail Mary situation here. Haha, <laughs> Clinton Dix. One-handed OBJ interception. Game set and match all the mistakes that i made all the crazy shit that happened to me that game let's go we got the w all right so i don't have enough coins to open up one pack but i do have a large quick sell and we're gonna get just enough for a pro pack so that's awesome and i do have two gold upgrade packs i'll open those after i open up the pro pack of course looking for a new running back i think that would be really the only thing that i need right now uh to complete the offense i'm trying to run 
Uh, Mark Ingram's okay. Like, I'm not going to say he's bad, but uh, I definitely like a more speedy running back. Uh, so we get Quentin Rollins and an Arthur Motes. Not sure why I can use him, but uh, I do remember Arthur Motes being kind of really, you know, balanced. 82 speed, 88 pursuit, 89 hit, uh, hit power, but only 69 strength. So he's not the strongest linebacker. He's not going to be getting off blocks or anything like that. So I don't know. I mean, I still got those two gold upgrade packs. Maybe I can get lucky. Maybe I can get, you know, one of those new running backs that just came out. Uh, Darren Sproles, like I said, does have like 90 speed. But he has like 99 acceleration and 99 agility. That would definitely be really awesome. So we open up one. Really? Really? Like, is that like the game trolling me right there? I'm not going to make a comment about that. You guys can laugh about that down in the comments. But next gold upgrade pack is Will Beatty. Um, not too many upgrades at all. Will Beatty is definitely not an upgrade. And, of course, Mark Ingram. Uh, can I combine those two Mark Ingrams and make uh, another Alabama running back? Can I get Eddie Lacy or something like that? I mean, that might actually be kind of funny to do. You know, combine two of the same players and make something uh, better. Uh, but, yeah, we're not going to do that. It's just kind of funny to say. I, I don't really know what type of rules that would be if we pull two of the same players besides Schefter Stars. Uh, but, yeah, Arthur Motes, go ahead and put him at middle linebacker number two. That's going to be the only upgrade of the video. Go ahead and give it a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new, and I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Peace.